pajama time! Hey everyone, it's Kidu. So I'm gonna be doing an unboxing of Kei Tsukushima's Nendroid from Haikyuu. Um, I did order him from the Good Smile Company, so he did come with the little rubber strap key chainy thing of him making his I don't know what kind of expression that is, but he's he's being sarcastic. Um so here's the front of the box. Sorry for the like weird lighting. I don't know what's happening. And like there's weird glares. Anyways. I wanna block it, but I can't. There. Front of the box. Side of the box. Back of the box. Other side of the box. Look at him. And I'm on the top. Bottom. He's number 616. They make it a lot of androids nowadays, if you ask me. That's so many they have. And he's not even the newest one. There's even more. It is really late. I am really tired. I still need to shower tonight. Nobody's going to watch any of these videos tonight because it's late. So here we go, we're just gonna do this real quick. Here is his packaging and how he looks there. The glare is horrible, I apologize. Of course, the normal base that comes with, he has glasses, so I'm wondering how they stay on his figure. Um, yeah, he comes with the normal base, that's like the volleyball, whatever I think. Does he come with a net? See, I'm surprised. They have a pose of him. Oh, he even has uh, his sports glasses. They actually look kind of scuffed up, but he's like, yeah, sports glasses. Um, I find it funny that they don't give the nets anymore. They only did for Kageyama and Hinata. And they have a pose of him blocking, but they don't have a net. So you can't really pose him blocking with the net. Uh, and he comes with his Sony headphones. You can't see. It doesn't say Sony. It says Sony. Um, headphones that sit around his neck to make uh, his more casual pose. Of course, he comes with the volleyball and all of that. He comes with um, this more serious kind of unimpressed look. And also, his like sarcastic -y expression face. And of course, I'll be doing a closer look of him when I pose him and everything. Um, I will just show you super quick again how he's packaged. He has all his different arm pieces for posing. Uh, his glasses sit there. There's the volleyball and his headphones, face plates, different legs for different poses. Um, I'm just giving him a look over because so here he is. Uh, right now there is a plastic piece behind his glasses so that you do not so they don't scratch his face. Looking at his hair because I wanted to see if it was shiny or not because lately we've been having some issues at least with the Kenma figure that his hair was glossy and that shouldn't be. His hair is not really bad at all, especially because it's blonde, you can't really tell. Uh, I do see a few mold lines, uh, which is unfortunate. Anyways, I'll talk about that more in the close-up. So here is tiny kit Suki, little Suki, in his angry little face. How do you take his glasses off? Oh, so his glasses just have these little pegs right here. I don't know if you can see the peg like that. And he has little parts in the side of his hair. You just stick them in there. And I'm going to take the plastic out of his face. See, but you know what I notice? Is his face is really glossy. This face plate isn't. And this face plate isn't. So I'm probably going to complain to Good Smile and see if they'll send me a better one. Because his uh, face, I don't think you can tell in this lighting. But um, 
he's super shiny. Like, it looks like his face... He looks like a greasy kid. He looks like he has a really, really greasy face. And I'm nervous that their nendroids are going to start doing this. They're going to start end up being, um... Like, not as good quality. And I'm worried because they, like... The prices are going up. And... Their quality is going down. Yeah, he's so glot like he literally looks like he has a greasy face, like he needs to go and wash his face. Um, he has some plastic in his center. Stuck to my fingers. Again, his clothes don't look horrible, but I feel like mm, the quality of him isn't as bad. I feel like Kenma's legs and arms were really rough feeling. I haven't felt any of the other ones, but these arms don't feel too bad. But his face looks weird. But even the feeling of, of his face here is more of a rough texture, you know what I mean? Like, it just seems like they're using a cheaper material. Like, it's not PVC anymore or something. Or, like, a... I don't know, they're not polishing him the right way. Because normally they have, like, a really silky smooth, like, skin feeling. And now he feels like cheap plastic. Like, it honestly feels like cheap plastic. Um, I will definitely be emailing them. I guarantee you they probably will say their entire stock is like that. And they won't, um, they won't do anything about it. Well, I will be posing him later. I am extremely tired. I was going to do both tonight, but I think I'm just going... To do this one and then upload the other one later but yeah so here is tiny Suki he's really cute with his glasses uh, like I said I will be contacting good smile about the face um, plate complaints I'm also gonna check uh, to see if anybody else is seeing the same issues that I am either way um, actually I'll hold him I'll hold him I really appreciate you guys watching this. Uh, this was the unboxing of Suki's Nedroid. And I will see... I, look how cute. Anyways, um, I will see you guys in the next video. And um, yeah, I got Twitter and a Tumblr. I've had Tumblr for a long time. Twitter's new. But yeah, so I will put links in the description below for everything. And also for Tokyo Taku Mode. I'll put a link in the description below for that. And I think that is about it. So again, thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you guys in this video.